going to remind him that yeah. uh, I hope he has taken note uh, <laughs> of that warning from uh, his his whip <laughs> in terms of which party he is allegiance. You are not here the other day when we asked him how come you are you're in one party but you are advocating for another party. Yes. Which doesn't make sense, which is the problem in Kenyan politics. I want to say hello to our viewers and also uh, join my colleagues in remembering the life of one of my uh, people in Machakos, the Honorable George uh, Ndenge, who passed away at the age of 94 uh, from COVID complications. This is a man who had a lot of strength, talked to his family, and they said that uh, he was on oxygen, and they do believe that if it was not for COVID, he was in very good health. He probably would have lived longer. And COVID is taking away a lot of our people, and it's good to talk about what kills our people, so yeah. that people know that it is injured. Because if you hide it, people don't realize. Uh, uh, I will miss him. He was a great man. I, he died before I could fulfill a promise I made to him of taking him and his wife on holiday to Mombasa. Uh, and then COVID came about and then there was no movement. So I'm, I'm, I'm slightly sad about that. He was a big supporter and he always told me that one day I'll be the president of this country. So in his memory, I want to tell him that I'll work hard to fulfill those uh, ambitions. He was a good man. He was a good man and a liberator and he fought for the liberation of this country. I also want to congratulate our heroes uh, who performed uh, in uh, Japan, maybe not as well as we expected, yeah. and we can do better. And I think Kenya needs to consider looking at a broad based, uh, a broader participation. We can't just be running or boxing or just volleyball. We need to even do archery. You know, I mean, we, we've got communities here who are known to be very good with the spear. Yeah. Our brothers and sisters from Maasai land, for example, are very good with the spear. You know, why can't we get our people uh, throwing the javelin many more than just the ones we've had? Uh, my community, Ukambani, we have known to be, and also my colleagues also in Meru, are known to be very good with archery. Yeah. You know, we give them a bow and an arrow, and uh, we, can, we can fire at, uh, at a dick dick, you know, at an antelope, yeah. moving, and we still get it. And so why can't we have more of our people trained? So we need to broaden so that we can participate in more sports than just the traditional ones that we've had, yeah. so that our people can participate. Um, Eliud Kipchoge, I want to acknowledge. I, I woke up, uh, I did not wake up, I did not sleep at 1 a.m. to watch him. And I watched him until he won. And uh, the others, you know, and how they performed. And I did not watch him because uh, he's from Wasingishu County. No, he's from Nandi. He's from Nandi County. Yeah. Or that he's Kalenjin. I watch him because he's Kenyan. I didn't care. He could have been a Kamba, he could have been a, a Matangi here, who's a Marathon, he could have been a Luo. We didn't care as Kenyans. We sat up to watch Eliud Kipchoge because he's Kenyan. Yeah. And this is where we forget most of the time. We get into politics, it's all about tribes. But it's not, tribe is not that important. It's our cultural heritage are important. Our cultural heritage are important, yeah. but they should not be everything. Now to the topic of this today, I want to agree with my presidential colleague here that elections are about people choosing their leaders. And they are not just about an individual or another individual. And we've got, we've been put in a box where it's always about one person or the other. And uh, there's work that has been done, especially our media, which I believe has failed us for a long time because they have tried to push a certain agenda of individuals instead of policies. And that's a, it's either this one or this one. But as my colleague said, people will be surprised in 2022. We need to have awakening where you realize that all these people have been there. There was a clip I saw uh, last night that was being shown of the president uh, with the, the leaders in Mombasa. And then it was a clip of Moi those days being received at KICC by a very, very young Uhuru Kenyatta, Rail Odinga, Kalonzo Musioka, William Ruto, uh, Mudavadi, all these players we are seeing are the same ones who are there about, what, 20 years ago? Mm. Yeah. The same, same guys, 20 years ago. And so maybe it's a time for us to wake up as a people and say that it's a time for fresh and it's a time to move on. And uh, I do not, I have not heard that the president, I have not talked to him, but uh, I'll find out. Uh, I don't think there was any endorsing of, Ra of Raila. Absolutely. I don't know where that's coming from. Uh, uh, you know, people can meet and talk, you know, and it's too early to start endorsing anybody. And they talk about coalitions there. As Mandela Chap Chap Party, we have said that we are first going to get our house in order, uh, make sure that we've got our structures all the way on the ground, 
have our people and then get the delegates and everything and then from there we will decide which coalition we are going to uh, will join us not necessarily join them so it, we can continue Ray Lodinga has served this country for a long time he cannot be uh, you know disregarded and this country for a long time I think we can all agree owes him he was detained for a long time he's worked very hard he's a man I know personally he's a good man uh, William Ruto has also worked very hard for this country they are leaders so we need to respect each other because politics is not just about an individual it's about us and at the end of the day as I finish is that uh, there's a uh, a viewer who watches this program is called uh, Reverend Felix Komu of SEK. And uh, he always, you know, it reminds me when I talk to him that it's about the track record. What is the track record of these fellas we are seeing there? And, you know, politics changes. And I want to remind Kenyans that all these people you are seeing there have been in different political parties. Do you know that uh, ODM, the founders of ODM, were Uhuru Kenyatta, <laughs> Raila Odinga, Kalonzo Musyoka, all these were founders of ODM. I mean, Uru Kinyata has his signature appended as a founder of ODM. Uru Kinyata, William Ruto there with the Pentagon, there as ODM. So, you know, <coughs> these political parties, they come and go. I mean, I was in Waipa. Others will be in Manuel Chap Chap and move to others. Others will be in Jubilee and move to other parties. They're in TNA. You know what I mean? So, we can't be lied to that it's only about politics changes but it's about the track record who best can really lead this country and that's what I want to tell uh, St. Chirangai and others that uh, watch this space here because it's not about individuals it's about the plight of Kenyans a lot of our young people are home they are jobless it's about fixing this country okay. and the best person to do it all right